when you hear the governor is going to talk about jobs, what is it that you're looking to hear specifically for, for, for your district? Oh, well, I can tell you what, what I'm looking to hear from my district is how we're not only going to maintain the jobs that we currently have, but how do we attract new businesses to relocate into the state of Illinois? I, I think one of the issues we have as a state is we're not considered to be too business friendly. Uh, that's uh, an image that we have to change. How do we do that? Is, is, is that taxes? Is that regulation? Is that just, you know, Illinois has got a black eye and it's going to take five, six years to get past that? It's a combination. And uh, as you all know, I introduced legislation uh, to lower the corporate uh, tax rate back to 4.8% from 7. Um, if you look at that, that would bring us roughly at about the uh, the second lowest state in our region, if you consider surrounding states, uh, second only to Kentucky. We've got to find a way to create jobs. We've got about a 10% unemployment rate in the, in the state. And you know, there's a reason they call it income tax when you're talking about paying income tax, because you have to have an income to pay income tax. Who's, who's hiring down in that part of the state? If, I mean, if I'm out of work, where, where do I go? You, you always hear about job training, but you know, do the jobs that we're being trained for match up with the jobs that are even open? Um, you know, that's a great point, and here's what I can tell you. It, it, nationally, about one in six people work for the government, okay? Uh, the government cannot support uh, all employment. What we've got to do is we have to concentrate on small business. Reason being, small business is the backbone of our country. Um, small businesses hire the majority of people in this country. So we've got to find a way to work with small businesses uh, attract the ones that aren't in Illinois to Illinois and uh, find a way to pay uh, good living wages. How much more difficult is this because it's a border region, because people can live and work in two separate states? I'm stuck here in central Illinois. I'm not moving to Indiana and driving into the Illinois capital every single day. I mean, I'm working where I'm living. But, but in, in, in a border region, when you talk about jobs and competitive disadvantage, how different is that to some of the other lawmakers who, who are sitting here who will listen to the speech tomorrow? Oh, it's obviously very different. And, uh, you know, it's just, it, it is what it is, and, and it's something that we're faced with. And because we're in a border situation, especially in southern Illinois, um, it's something we have to consider and be very competitive.